Okay guys, welcome back to another video. This is episode 8 of the Germany. Let's play, let's get straight into the video. Well then, yesterday we attacked the Netherlands. Today you can see we have fully annexed them without a problem. This is good news. Definitely boost our economy a lot, you can see that, it's pretty insane. 8200 per hour, 207,000. Also, Spain attacked us. So we're gonna have to deal with them. Let's send some units over here. We won't need too many, at least I don't think. Let's just send them to the front line for now. We're not gonna start pushing yet. We won't need too many units. There we go, that should be enough, I think. Looking at front reports, we captured some stuff, produced some units, which is great. And that's basically it. Let's get motorized level 5. And better interceptors too. There we go. Let's send... A little bit more over here, just to be sure. We have a good amount of units anyway, no need to worry. So, as you can see, we're doing extremely well in, here in the USSR. We've captured Novosibirsk and Krasnoyarsk, which is just great. They have two of these units. If we get like one median tank, we can just take that out without a problem. We'll take one of these, let's get some of this artillery. And these light tanks here too. Hopefully they can get here in time. And uh, with these two mediums, let's keep pushing over here to Irkutsk. And uh, you can start moving towards Vladivostok. That's gonna take another two days, it seems. But no problem. We should be able to take that city then. Let's also uh, keep going with this unit over here. There we go. And uh, Central Asia is basically owned by us at this point, let's just keep pushing. With this unit we're gonna go here into Mongolia. With this let's uh, just clean the rest of this up. The unit is quite slow because uh, it has like no health. When your uh, unit has lower health, it goes slower as well, if you guys don't know. Uh, you're going over here, let's take this medium right after and let's uh, make it go over here as well to take these provinces that are voted to. With this let's take uh, Guryev back, revolted, and let's take this as well. Hopefully I should clean up the rest of this. There's also this thing over here, that province. Let's just send this infantry or something. There we go. Uh, this infantry is here, you can keep going. One can go over here, that's gonna take literally days by itself. And uh, this other one can go over here, through the north as well. Just to take this land, make the map look nicer, I suppose. So there we go. Alright, this should be cleaned up at least mostly. That's great. Let's keep producing stuff, because our military definitely needs to be made better. 130 units at this point, that is not bad at all. Let's build some more though. In level 5, tank plants. Of course, a motorized and artillery. Latvia has a trade embargo with us. So this means they'll probably attack us soon. So I'm gonna prepare some units. Right now I'm also gonna declare war on Lithuania. They only have one province, so they don't have any units. At least I bet they don't. So let's send this militia over here and this anti-tank. This one can go here too, as defense. Let's send some more units for Latvia. Then we also take out Estonia after that. Let's get some units here. Some mediums, some motorized, some artillery. We won't need much. Let's send this uh, railroad gun as well here. There we go, let's send a little more for this province right here. It probably has like one unit. So let's send, I don't know, these two infantry units or something. There we go. Let's prepare the heavy will take Lithuania. And now let's declare war on Denmark. We should be able to win this. There we go. And we own half of their country. Now it's just gonna be about this fight, which we should be able to win easily. We're also fighting their navy, which we will win against their navy. And then it's just gonna be about this, which we should be able to win, I'm not sure about that though. So let's send this medium tank over here as well, and we'll be able to win. Yeah, we're gonna win this easy. Easily, no question about it. So, well, Denmark is ours, just like that. There we go. Right of way is pretty powerful sometimes. However, we need to be careful declaring war on everybody, because our relations with... Countries will go down and they might declare war on us later. So gotta keep an eye on that. Well then, we're doing uh, just about everything. Let's send this railroad gun uh, over here as well. It's gonna help us against uh, the Spanish. We're also beating them here, which is good. They already have some casualties, not very many though. 
and soon when we have Spain will be the biggest economy probably. Let's keep building industry in these places though Nuremberg and everything is gonna help a lot. We got loads of money so we can afford to use it for industrializing in Frankfurt as well. There we go. Just gotta keep that uh, industry up and build it up so we can surpass the US economy which we should be able to do especially when we annex uh, the Baltics and uh, well since we annex Denmark that's gonna help a lot and when we annex all of Spain yeah we're gonna be pretty massive so yeah anyway that's gonna be it for this video I think we're producing everything we're uh, attacking uh, Lithuania, Denmark preparing to invade Spain and also preparing to invade Latvia which we'll do both of those things tomorrow so yeah anyway i'll see you guys tomorrow thank you for watching and good bye